Hi, this video explains your individualized sulfur rates and row spacing report. It includes individual, regional and national averages of sulfur product applied per hectare, per 100 meters, per application and for the whole season. Adjusting spray volumes based on your row spacing, training system and canopy density is critical. This is emphasized in the New Zealand Wine Spray Application Rate Guidelines. Your report contains a link to this resource. For the first time, the report displays the results based on your vineyard's most common training system and split between a medium and dense canopy. The two scatter graphs plot the average sulfur application rate for all vineyard blocks that match your main training system against their row spacing. The blue dotted lines are the manufacturer's label rate, plus or minus 20%, adjusted for row spacing, training system and canopy density. Your vineyard's blocks are shown as orange diamonds. If your vineyard falls outside this band, then we recommend reviewing your application rates. While there can be vineyard specific reasons for being above or below this band, your individualized report should be used as part of your annual pest and disease control review. On the report, a link is provided to a New Zealand wine fact sheet on assessing and adjusting spray coverage. The two graphs along the bottom show the distribution of sulfur applied in New Zealand and specifically in your region, both per pass and for the whole season. Where your vineyard sits in the distribution is highlighted. Thanks for participating in this benchmarking and reporting program.